We have come to Marangi Bay Beach, one of the beaches in North Shore of Auckland. And today it's full moon and also supposedly Red Moon Day. Oh, night, nice, sorry. So it happens once in 40 years. The Earth comes between moon and sun. So that's when Red Moon occurs. We are waiting. It's uh, supposedly to be seen at 11 p.m. So Sami and myself have come for a walk and there is a toy library here. We're going to grab some toys after this. Let's go Sami. Come. Yeah. Shall we go? Let's go. So this uh, beach is, as I said, located in North Shore. And one of the very quiet beach in terms of the waves because it's full moon you can see the waves are pretty rough and hitting hard on the shore actually I've never seen the waves so big here on this beach yes Sami let's go let's go to the library let's go okay Sami wants to go to the toy library which is just couple of minutes of walk from here we will go to the toy library and give you a sneak peek of what is it all about so it's a community based library where you can actually get toys for hire it's good if you have young kids because the kids generally get bored of the toys within a week or even less so it's a good chance for parents to basically go and change the toys and get new ones. So it works on a subscription basis and you basically renew it once a year. Okay, let's go Sambi. What are you touching? What is that? What is that? Hello. Let's go. what is it all about so this library has a lot of toys it's uh, perfect for kids and obviously parents who want to give different variety of toys for the kids kids generally get bored with the toys very quickly so this is perfect and ideal I'll you go inside and give a quick tour now Okay, we are just uh, inside the toy library. Um, so a lot of varieties here. This is based in North Shore, Mairangi Bay. So a good community initiative. Um, uh, generally open three days in a week just to come and return your toys and exchange your toys. And it works uh, on a very small membership fees. So you can see a lot of varieties here. Um, Sanmi and Slope pretty much have taken most of the toys home but it's good for them to get different varieties so this tractor is pretty good slow ones like it but we couldn't take it home because I just couldn't fit in a car so as you go inside um, varieties of puzzles here and it's all separated by number of years and Oh, more puzzles here so a huge selection so pretty much imagine a library but instead of books you'll have a lot of toys so very well organized so i've actually volunteered here um, so parents can volunteer just to come and help them to sort the toys and do returns so this is the baby room uh, so pretty much sorted for young babies they make a lot of noise and movements that's what they like so Sanvi is here with me helping to select which toys she would want to take home tonight so she generally selects for Shlok as well her brother 
So we will see what son we wants to take home tonight. So imagination. You found one? What is that? Show me. Yeah. What is that? Is that for you or Shlok? Shlok? Yes. Okay, you can get two more if you want. So, some more toys here. Very interesting mix. So these are construction toys. Uh, as you can see, good variety. So one thing is uh, really good is you don't have to buy. It's pretty much on a return basis. As I mentioned, the membership is very good. So, yeah, Sammy has taken a toy to the librarian and she's asking if she can take it home. And that's how simple it is. You select a toy and basically and give them the toy number and it will be issued on your card number. So these are the toys which I took last week. Now I'm returning these. Then I will do a quick check if all the parts are here and I'm finished with missing. If all good, then they will go back into the shelves and then you get to choose new toy. Do you want this puzzle? Yes. Don't open it, Sanvi. What is this? Cow. What do you do? Cow. So we will carry on and get some toys.